In this video, I'm gonna tell you the most important thing that you can do with your business. You will not be successful unless you do this one thing. There has been no business owner ever that has started a business without doing this one thing. It's just not going to happen. The most in the marketplace is the great arbiter of talent. The marketplace will say, hey, your shit's good. Your shit's not good. It's just that brutal. Important lesson, and you will not be able to start a business unless you do this, is getting started right now. That is the most important thing that you can do for your business, for your economic future, is to get started right now. Hey, this is Glendon Cameron, founder of HustlersKungFu.com. Be sure to get your free 19 business courses, one of the first links below. And if you want some swag, be sure to pre-order your t-shirt. Now, what will these courses do? They'll make you money, save you money, and teach you how to build a business, plus a whole lot more. I mean, that's it. Unless you get started right now doing these things, you're just not going to build that business because this is what happens. Um, you get people who are what I called in love with the process of starting a business, but not so much about the nuts and bolts and the implement implementation. Where you know where the rubber meets the road, actually doing stuff that leads to business development, sales, marketing, uh, sending out emails, putting together marketing campaigns, product development, talking to customers. Those activities are what start businesses and those activities are what create business owners. Many people have been looking at my videos, read the blogs. Some of you have been here for seven years and still have not started your business. Getting started with what you have, where you are, is of supreme importance. Because if you never get started, you're never going to have a business. It seems overly simple. It seems very, very elementary. But... There are people right now who are mad at someone else that went ahead and started the business that they wanted to start. They say things like, they stole my idea. They took my concept and other stupid shit. The reality is there's a lot of opportunity out here. There's a lot of uh, stuff. There's a lot of ways for people to make money. But unless you get started, nothing's gonna happen. You'll just be sitting where you're sitting, wondering what you're wondering, not doing anything. Now, I cannot overstate how important getting started is. I get many people who are like, well, so-and-so had money or this. Uber, one of the largest companies to come out of this dot com three, whatever you want to call it, in years got started like this. Travis hacked his way into Uber. He would call up, he didn't even have an app in the beginning. He would call up black car service companies and say, hey, how much for me to reserve so much space with your company for the month? Once we get so many riders, give me the uh, information and I'll pay you into the month. He, it, that, was, that was how Uber got started. He didn't even have an app. The app did not come until later. Now, I had to get this window fixed uh, this week, and that day that I was getting it fixed, I had a lot to do, so I was using Uber. Now, what's funny about this is on YouTube, there's a bunch of people saying you can't make any money with Uber. I quizzed these drivers, some that just started. One guy quit his job. He says, I routinely make 200 bucks a day. I work between 7 and 4 p.m. every day. $200 a day, 
1400 you know he said he works seven days a week because he's trying to get some stuff done 1400 you know 28 like 5600 bucks a month right he just started with uber with the lower rates and uh, some of the rates have changed because you know i haven't taken uber in a while but back on point travis didn't start with the uber infrastructure that you see today he started out not even having cars not even having drivers he outsourced took that information executed implemented a lot of people thought he was crazy gary v had a chance to invest invest early he passed but he got started and more importantly he stayed committed and he stayed in motion he didn't stop and i use uber because it's one of the most successful companies and it's one of the most controversial lawsuits uh people getting their cars towed uh people striking wasn't easy wasn't easy at all and most of you will not have to go through those kind of challenges to get your business started it's just it's just not gonna happen so get started stop playing around the marketplace is the great arbiter of talent the marketplace will say hey your shit's good your shit's not good it's just that brutal and that's why when I put my video you know why I say fuck white supremacy I have learned from many years of starting companies dealing with customers getting started staying started how brutal the marketplace is the marketplace I mean, it's the, 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 the marketplace makes racism look like a little kid in a crib that's screaming all day long. That's the marketplace. And I, I see people who are trying to, you know, cheat the marketplace, not invest in the marketplace and not go ahead and put their shit out there. Because this is the thing. I don't care how smart you are. I don't care how talented you think you are when you put your shit in the marketplace you're gonna find out for real if your shit is good as you think it is you can pontificate here in the comments with me you can talk with your friends you can whisper in your girlfriend's ear late at night I'm the shit but coming out here in the marketplace mm, a lot of you will find out you're not the shit you're just shit that's the reality of the marketplace. That's the reality of getting started. That is the reality of putting yourself in a elevated state of hustle, of pushing it out here, grinding it, because I got a track record of making money online since 2009. Still here, still doing it, still training, still creating courses, still writing books. I'm still doing the same thing. And there are people who, once again, when you get started, when you start your business and you start to go through these challenges that will come, challenges are coming. You start a business, I'm just going to let you know, it's coming. Now, this is the thing, and I told someone this this morning, the more problems that you have, the more money you will make. What is many people are trying to avoid? Problems. They're trying to avoid struggle. They're trying to avoid hard. They're trying to avoid sweat. They're trying to avoid failure. They're trying to avoid looking bad. All of those things that if you embrace and push forward will make you money. Avoiding them will just keep you safe. No, you won't get your feelings hurt. You won't get your feelings hurt. You, you won't be talked about. No one will point about a spelling error. No one will say, hey, that t-shirt design is whack. No one will go and talk shit about your course. That, that won't happen. It won't happen at all. But you won't be going to the gym in the middle of the day. You won't be hustling like you've never hustled before. You won't have that freedom of thought. That, Cause see, there's, there's something that happens when you become a successful business owner. You start to create your own world. If you look at everyone, from celebrities to athletes to business owners to <clears throat> founders, everyone creates their own environment. Zuckerberg, he bought the house on the left, he bought the house on the right, and he bought the house in the back to create a buffer. Everyone who has the ability 
and the options to create that unique that unique environment that is theirs that cuddles them that is comfortable that they enjoy that they desire everyone that reaches that level does it Hugh Hefner everyone because when you're living a life of intent and design that's just what's going to happen that's just what's going to happen so get started today with what you have where you are get the feedback from the marketplace get those lessons continue to execute continue to put your stuff out there and who knows where you'll be in five years who knows where you'll be in the next decade just saying if you like this video and you should and you like the content of this stuff and you should be sure to get your free 19 business courses one of the first links below and if you want more I no longer do free consults anymore and I no longer do free phone calls but if you want more you can schedule a consult below also if you like this channel recommend it to two or three friends shit recommend it to ten and if you find value in the content, and if you find value in what I offer you, pay what you want. Links below. So with that, I'll see you in the next video.